We're in Sweetwater, Florida, which is west of Miami, and this is the largest Nicaraguan community in the United States. We actually just had somebody come up to us and say, you don't look like you're from around here, which makes sense because this community is 94% Latino. Let's go check out Nicaraguan culture. Okay guys, so I got some authentic Nicaraguan chicken with white rice, which it actually says ooh, that it is one of their national foods is white rice actually. So chicken is delicious, really good. White rice cooked made, made really well. Queso frito. Queso frito, which is cheese toast. Very good. There's something very similar in Mexico. You can get it all in Mexico. Don't know the name. Still really good. Rojita. And Rojita, which has um, a, a Native American on it. Very delicious flavor. Very salty, which is very common in South American um, drinks. I couldn't really say why, but South Central American sodas all have very high salt concentration. It's something you'll always notice, I think. Would you say it's natural? No, um, but it is delicious. I got carne asada and gallo pinto. They gave me a lot of, this was $15. This is a lot of food for $15. That steak is really good. That steak is really, really good. The savory cheese really cuts the salt from the steak. <laughs> Gallo Pinto, I've heard a lot about this. Let's see if it lives up. Red beans and rice, never so nice as in Harlem. Let's try this. I like it. In the 1980s, basically 1979, communists were elected into government. Those would be the Sandinistas, and they would basically end up fighting a guerrilla war for the rest of the 80s with the Contras. And that strife is basically what led to this community growing here, people fleeing and looking for freedom. What did your family support? Like, what was your family family ideology, basically, your parents when you um, left? They, they just wanted freedom. They wanted liberty. They wanted to have choices. Um, That's so, why they left. Correct, correct. My father was incarcerated because he worked for the National Bank. Hmm. And um, the Sandinistas went in and wanted them to do illegal things. And when he said no, he, along with many others, were arrested. Um, so we were able to leave. And he had his paperwork, so when we came here, this wonderful country offered us asylum, political asylum, because he had been incarcerated by the Sandinista government. Do you think most of this community came around that time? Yes. So that's A what kind of built did. it? Yes. And because the, the, the civil wars, no, wait, the Sandinistas got in on 79, in 79. Um, then there was the civil war, so around early 80s to mid 80s, that's when you had the huge influx. Right here? Where I'm going. The, okay. the respados? Oh, the respados? No, that's, what about the uh, that's like ice cream. The one yeah. next to it. Oh, the one next to it? it Tortilleria? Tortilleria, right. Okay. Is it better than La Fritanga? To me, yeah. What is a fritanga, by the way? I know okay. the word, but... Um, it's, it's basically street food. It comes from frito, which means fried. Oh, okay. And um, that's how a lot of people make their living. You know, they're frying and, you know, it's uh, carne asada, which is beef. We have the tortilla, gallo pinto, which is red beans with white rice. That's your like, I've heard of gallo That's I like our staple, like yeah. the fried that cheese. And queso or frito the is a big one. Queso frito, right. It's a slice of white cheese and they fry it. And it's, oh my God, I don't know how many calories, but it's so good. What do you think of when you think of Nicaragua? Um, yo pienso que es un país centroamericano muy bonito. Eh, que tenemos un clima tropical bueno, eh, hay una diversidad de, de, de comida, mm -hmm. eh, lugares bonitos que pueden visitar en Nicaragua, eh, restaurantes, playas, eh, colinas, tiene, tiene varios tipos de clima, eh, hay muchos bosques, 
Pues es un país que tiene volcanes, uh -huh. eh, tiene islas, eh, tiene lo que yo sé que tiene dos lenguas, bueno, varias lenguas, español, en la costa atlántica hablan inglés, eh, también hablan dialecto. Eh, ¿Es una lengua indígena? Ya, yeah, una lengua indígena. Ok. Eh, hablan dialecto y es bien bonito. Y la gente es bien, bien acogedora y son humanitarios, una persona buena. Ok. ¿Qué es tu comida favorita de Nicaragua? Oh, me gustan todas. Ok, guys, that's a quick look at Little Managua out here. I hope you guys enjoyed. We spoke to some of the people that live here. They were really friendly, most of them, and I hope you liked it. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.